Hello there, Junior Boy here. Welcome to my favorite game of all time. The New War. Discover your power within. You know what? We are starting an entirely new game from scratch, so it doesn't even matter about this cutscene that you're seeing in this new cinematic. I've got a little bit of... Oh, we're downloading an update. That's fine. I'm going to do a little bit of background talk while we, we talk about this. Now, this scene that you're looking at right now is from the, the trailer. And da -da -da -da, that's fine. Um, so, I deleted all uh, the last series on Warframe that I had. I deleted all my previous videos prior to uh, the way too into this Star Wars Squadrons Part 1 video. Um, and then I realised, oh no, my mic's buffering. That wasn't what I meant to say. BRB. And then I discovered that, oh no, my Warframe save. The whole reason I started this new channel was an excuse to start Warframe again on an entirely new account because I like this game a lot. I've been playing it since I was 13 on my old channel shown here. Don't go and visit it. Seriously, don't. Um, but I went to... Oh, now we're picking up speed. Oh, yeah. I'm, I'm still on, on the Series X with this. So um, we're, 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 I'm looking at it in 60 FPS. I don't know if you guys are. I don't know. I don't, it just doesn't look like 60 FPS when I look at it in Lightworks. But, oh, well. That music's looking good. I'll jump right into it and get playing in just a moment. Assuming my mic doesn't have a fart. Oh, there we go. That sounds exactly like a fart. So I'll be playing this game from uh, the beginning all the way up to, well, all the way up to we run out of stuff to play. Uh, now, I've just finished Carry On, so this playthrough will luckily be replacing that. I was going to replace uh, Star Wars Squadrons, but then I realised, oh no, I've just finished a Let's Play, actually. Um, I'll, I'll just, I'll just, it'll just take that slot. Uh, I'm going to try and get through as much as I can in this episode. It can be a little bit of a longer one, why not? Sure, let, let's get away with it. Warframe. Oh my god. I can't wait to get back into playing this game, just, just on and off camera. The new war. Excalibur. Oh, I missed this menu. How quick do you load up? Mike, please do me a favor. Stop. Wait, what are you doing? Oh, yeah. Um, you know what? I'm liking this. I'm liking this outfit. I'm, I'm, I'm feeling it. it. You know what? I think it looks better than my normal casual stuff, and it doesn't feel uncomfortable or anything. So, you know what? I like myself a flannel. It, I think it looks decent. Let's begin. I have not played this game in a while, and I, I can't wait to get back into it. Let's do it. For generations you've slept. No purpose. No call to wake you. of the old war, swallowing colonies whole. But there's still hope. The Tenno, monuments of an ancient warrior caste. Scattered across frail worlds.
end to an empire. Then they left. Forgotten. Like a dream. Dareth intrude upon my slumber. <sighs> it's only six o'clock. I see the lotus has tried to wake you. Pity she's too late. Funny how much of that applies You're to you. My prize now. Funny how much Dead of that doesn't. No. We are taking this one with us. What has he done to you? I can't lose another Tenno. Another? How interesting. I'm surging your Warframe's power systems. Quick, use your power. Defend yourself. Oh, defense doesn't come into it. Oh, okay, yeah, that's so I don't actually need to press A anymore. Um, why is the range on this? Come on. Oh, I've missed this button scheme. I've missed the feel of this game. Do you mind? Come on, get some range going, bro. Come on. Excalibur, what are you doing? Oh, Mike's being a, being a An douche. An ship is waiting for you, but the Grenier will be hunting you. Arm yourself. The visuals on the uh, on the communications have been improved. It would seem that the visuals on everything have been improved. Uh, is my mic okay? I don't actually think that's the mic. I think that's the rain. Oh, we've got the Plains of Idol on soundtrack. We've got the rain. Oh, the rain looks good. It's not a bit. It doesn't actually look like it's landing. It looks like it. It doesn't actually look like it's hitting the floor. It just kind of looks like it's a rain effect applied to my screen. But whatever, doesn't matter. Um, press A to jump. All right, nice jump through there. That's a very bright light. Relax. All right. Scanner. Yes. Ah, melee. Ah, look at this. I like this game. Right. There we go. Okay. So it won't always be a one-hit kill because this game is a looter shooter slasher. Looter, looter shooter slasher. Right. Would anybody prefer a slice? I can hear someone shouting Tenno. Okay. Loot. There we go. Just take care of you. And where where is my next opponent? There's a bunny over there. Are you are you the one that was foretold to be my match? Um There's okay. a cache of weapons ahead. Grab what you can. Don't mind if I do. How much has this tutorial level been changed? I don't even remember this last time I played the updated tutorial level. Lato, don't mind if I do. I've, I, I've very, oh, oh, that was a bird. I shouldn't have done that. What have you guys been doing to this village? You know, it doesn't look like you're wanted here. I feel like if you were, you wouldn't have had to commit to such destruction. So in other words, leave now. Too late. Simple stuff. Right, who's shooting me? Good. The extraction point is up ahead. Hurry, before Vor finds out you've escaped. Oh, he's welcome to find out. He's not going to do anything about it. So, what to be in this direction? Alright, easy stuff. Tenno flows like fire over the battle terrain. Do you remember how to dash up walls? I mean, there were fire back there, so I, I don't really want to take tips from that thing. 
Oh, nice hit that loot. There's money's over there. I don't remember this area. Uh, I, I, oh, I can slide. Oh, yeah, bullet jump. That's what it's telling me I do. Yeah, I've played this game before, so I already know the bullet jump. Thank you very much. Um, ah, I love the movement in this game. Great. Yeah, so that's that's the rain. That's not my mic. I'm happy to hear that. Basic traversal. Salvage team, why have you not reported it? Uh, I may be. There's the extraction ship. Good to see you. Funny how much of that doesn't apply to you. So, Captain Vore, whose soundtrack do you think this is? Because it will, it will be the deciding factor in the victor of this confrontation. Well, there is no uh, soundtrack actually. I don't care if you see me, Vore. You're gonna have to leave. This one is stronger than the rest. It's Knock the area down. This Tenno is mine. Though, I think you'll find that I'm not stronger than the rest. Quick, you just get to the console and release the lockdown. Do that, and I will guide you to your old ship. To my old ship? Why was that chance. not the one I was? Okay, sure. Though, I think you'll find that I'm not stronger than the rest. You're just normally too afraid to fight some fight one that's awake. Release lockdown. Sure, let's go. The Queens want to destroy you, but I need to know more. Oh, I killed the bunny. That wasn't quite how I planned this morning. It's not morning, but you know. Um. Uh, yay! I'm not a very silent person. I think I think that that much is, is obvious. Oh yeah, you got the you got the aim glide. You got this. You know that's nice. I, li I like that. That's always been a, a feature of the game. Unlike the bullet jump, which was uh, not always a feature of the game. Uh, well, it was always have fun in orbit, sir. I mean, you know, there was always there was always a move set that was mapped to the same button that bullet jump is, but it wasn't a bullet jump. It was more like a more like a front flip. But now we just we just do this. You know, that, that's that's a uh, we do that now. You know, I'm going to have to suggest that you don't. Just as a general rule, like I stick to the principle of not doing that. Alright, thank you. Wakey wakey. I am not cooking you eggs, Stop any eggs, you. or baking beans. What? Are my senses deceiving me? Operator, is that you? It is. All this I've missed you. Ship Cephalon, we require immediate extraction. The operator is in danger? I will need a few moments to cycle the engines. Do what you need to, my boy. Tenno, are you afraid? No. You cannot hide from me, sword guard. You are the one that ran away. I want you. You will return to me. You might want... Yeah, you know what? I will. You're right. I, I will return to you. You might not want to be so gleeful about that. You know what? It would be safe to say, it would be safe to describe my uh, relationship with this game as an addiction. I'm not going to lie. I'm going to be completely honest and self-aware. That's probably the most accurate description. Ah. You know what? I'd feel bad for you guys if you didn't destroy a village and then try to kill me. Slash control me. So, unfortunately, you've kind of, you've kind of, oh, I don't, how did you fit down there? Have you seen the size of you? That worked. Oh, that thing looks fancy. Now that sounds like my microphone. Whee! Oh, this is not that nice. Ah, yes, the tip screen, the loading screen, the daily rewards. This looks interesting. Hello, Davo. Gallium, I have no use of that for quite a while. Ball's prize with all ship Operator, you have returned. I am Ordis, ship Cephalon, a shadow of my former self. I cannot serve the operator in such a condition. Of course you can. Order me to self-destruct. I will understand. No. 
The Grenier are ravenous for this old technology. It is superior to theirs. Huh. Perhaps there are systems left in the orbiter compartment? Allow me to just turn me to shut off. Those savages. Components have been removed. The lower orbiter compartments have no life support. Why did the operator abandon me? Arsenal management could be restored if the operator wishes it. I'm going to go over to Q&A. Can I turn chat off for the time being? I don't need it. I'll turn it back on when I do. Hang on. Yay, there we go. So that works. Right. So, Oris, what was thy request? Oh, Arsenal. Nice. It's all the segment. Oh my god, there's an actual animation for this now. So, okay, DE, I love you guys. This is awesome. But why? <laughs> Out of everything that needed changing and improving you in the honor, game. honor, Ordis. Now I can supply the operator with better modded firepower. Oh, the violation. Those have been looted as well. That's alright, let's get them back. Like, I love the animation, it's great. You need to figure out it, what but... Captain Vor has done to you and stop him. Um, but we'll need help. I found a communication segment we might salvage for your ship. Nice. When you are ready, activate your navigation system. Right, let's let's do that and Orders stop never. Punish the Grenier for dismantling it. I will, don't you worry. Um, so, where are we going? Uh, no, that's fine. Uh, restore ship's communications. Let's do that. E-Prime on Earth. What kind of mission is this? Uh, it is... Is it actually set? Oh, it's just a quest. Okay, so I thought it was going to give me like a mission type, but apparently not. Oh, I've missed everything about this game. Like, I'm not complaining about the fact that I added that little animation, but why? Oh, wow. Just, oh, it all looks so beautiful. I don't know if that's a Series X talking or just my nostalgia or if they've actually improved it. So, let's drop in. I think I actually could have changed the way the my segment character you need looked. Is in a nearby data vault. Infiltrate the vault and retrieve the segment. Oh. The Ascaris is working, breaking through. I see the shadows of your mind. Well, take a good long look, good sir. Because currently you won't have a mind. I will break it. <laughs> yeah, we're going to start off getting lots of flawed mobs, aren't we? I just killed a dog. Um... Don't worry, those are those are feral dogs. They'll kill you. With a variety of security measures. How you defeat those measures is up to you. Nice. I've... Okay, cool. So I'm starting to develop XP up there in the top right. Uh, we are now looking at. I'll get back to you on that. Let me open these up. Oh god, I just realised like how weak my character is at the moment. Don't you worry. Power creep is, is a thing in this game that people have been trying to get over forever. If you trigger the alarms now, the enemy will start destroying data. Oh, the spy missions. I've missed them. What's, can we go all the way over here? Oh, well, I know we can, but like, why? Does, does that help me? It does. And there are no little robot sensors. I'm having a laugh. But there's someone shooting at me. So, hang on a sec. Oh, no, okay, that's, I, sh I should have been quicker and done that. So we set up the alarms, and if that timer reaches zero, then, well, the data's purged and we lose. But unfortunately for the Grenier, that's not going to happen, because I've, you know, hacking is easy. The data is still intact. The segment is yours. Head to extraction. The segment is mine. As every moment passes, the Ascoris burrows deeper. Pray it doesn't get stuck. Okay. What what do you expect that to mean, bruh? What do, you, what do you expect to find? Can I ask? Just just out of curiosity, because at this point, uh, at this point, you've built the intrigue up to like I don't even know what was in my own mind. And that, like the way, surely, surely there's something in my mind that I don't know of for you to be so interested. Because honestly, if you were asking me, there's nothing there. Uh, I I you know, I'm not the smartest tool in the shed. I will I will readily admit that. Um, so, what 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 gives, man? Uh, let me just kill all these guys. And get, some, uh, get some get some XP, and then I'll 
head to extraction. All right, okay, never mind. I was going to do a jump cut, but we're, we're, we're done, it would seem, so let's make our way there. Uh, I have no idea where to begin when it comes to killing you guys. That's not something I used to struggle with. I have no idea where to begin when it comes to leveling up my character. Um, my good old Excalibur, am I going to focus on getting some sensor mods first, a sentinel, uh, so, uh, shield and health, probably good start. Maybe, actually, a good start would be getting mods that aren't flawed, because, well, I don't like flaws. No, we've got a comm segment, so let's go fill that in. Wow. Orbiter Void Cloak engaging. Welcome back, Operator. The Operator has recovered a segment. In in install it now. Ordis patiently awaits its installation. Worry not, Ordis. So, yes. Get communications online. I must analyze what Vor's Ascaris is doing to your Warframe. Cool, let's do this that. This technology is beyond the Grenier. It must be Corpus in origin. Mm, all right, let's let's do that. Let's investigate. Oh, I'm not witnessing it. Systems That's more like oh, oh dear. I suppose this will do. Ordis is grateful. The operator is now connected with other Tenno in the system. The operator may now contact black market scumbags. Contact arms dealers. Excellent idea, Ordis. Tenno. We need to make contact with a corpus defector sympathetic to the Tenno cause. What is the they Tenno will, cause? of course, require compensation. You see what Ordis is referring to, Operator? No. In this case, compensation will not be credits. It will be freedom. I've updated navigation. You will need to break him out of a Grenier Gulag. Well, they have Gulags, so I'm not at all at hot with that suggestion. Let's go do that. All right, let's see what's in Gulag number one. Ah, I've missed these. We're probably gonna start. I'm floating. We're probably gonna start. The arms um, dealer is named Darbo. He's being held in the prison block on the other side of this factory complex. Sounds good. I'm probably gonna start skipping those introductions in every mission because, well, they play every mission, and you've pretty much seen all of them that they have to offer. You don't, you don't need anything else. You drop through a vent, you jump out your ship. That's pretty much it. slaves died to build this place. Um, I, I can't say I know, but if you ever need my help with that, I don't have much else to do in this game at the moment because I don't really have access to anything. So just let me know. out for himself. But he is sympathetic toward the Tenno. The Grenier must have found out. The Ascaris is working. Breaking through. I see the shadows of your mind. Do you want to stop repeating yourself? Don't let more distract you. Focus on the mission. It's our only hope of figuring out this link with him. Right, let's have a look. So. We're going to get all the loot that we can, uh, that, that we can get our hands on, because we might encounter some very valuable items. And truth be told, we don't want to be missing out on them. Oh, oh I fell down here. Uh, any, any loot to speak of? Anything useful? Oh, that hurt. Barely. Wait, have I got extra health? Is that just due to me leveling up? or did I, Yeah, no, it must be. Cause I don't... Yeah, no, it does, because your maximum health without mods is 300, and I don't have any mods installed, so it must be that. So if I level up again, I should get... Oh, hang on. Should get a little bit of health. No, I got some... I got some, uh, shield. Nice. And then next will be, uh, energy, I believe. Now, you guys are too weak at the moment for me to need to do anything with, uh, energy, but... This is the prison block. If you can avoid detection by the warden, it may be easier to get Darbo out. Well, let me just turn the alarms off. So we can enter. I thought I just took damage then, that's not good. This area is heavily fortified, survey the area and proceed with caution. Come on. Come, come on. I'm doing the thing. Oh, there we go. Normally you can stand on that and it you just if you just do the thing it jumps onto the wire. Got him. Oh, I leveled up. Gotta love it. Gotta love it. Get that mastery rank up. There we go. Solved. 
Got him. Yeah, a little bit of a. But you get you get extra. So XP in this game is known as affinity, and you, if you get stealth kills, you get um, a lot more. I will give my entourage to meet us in orbit once we're clear of this mess. Nice. Let's do it. Let's go. Extraction is ready. Remember, your success here depends on getting Darvo out of there alive. That's okay because unless they've changed it, which I sincerely hope they haven't, you don't actually have to get them. Like even if they, even if the the rescue target gets downed, you don't actually have to get to. The Lotus must be desperate to send you fetching greedy fools from the corpus. You must be desperate to now, not be here in person. the Ascaris has burrowed deep enough to give me influence. Shall we see how your shields work? Do demonstrate. The Ascaris is letting Vor control your shield. We must figure out how to remove it. Sure. Avoid taking damage while I try and block him. I mean, he, uh, he's not actually done anything to my shields. <laughs> He's not, he's literally not done anything to my shields. Oh, let's bring that down. Alright, see you guys in a sec. So, what are we I looking at? I see the operator can enable the mod segment now. Ordis will be delighted to show you how to upgrade your arsenal. No May need. I recommend fire? Yeah, go for it. Assuming we have that. I believe we do, actually. Oh, look at this. Go on. Do the good, do the thing. Operator, I've linked the mod segment to your arsenal now. No Can I upgrade it? Me. Uh, I don't have any of those now. now. Go to the arsenal to see the weapon upgrade options you have. Right. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna need money. So I'm gonna no. You know what? I'm always gonna sell for. I can get money very easily. So I'm always gonna sell for. If I have any duplicates whatsoever. Ordis patiently awaits compliance in using the new arsenal features. It is for the operator's own good. Very well. Let's do it. Let's have a look. An excellent find, operator. There are hundreds of these mods to locate. If my calculations are correct, there are exactly a lot of possibilities. Mm -hmm. Install the mod before we can continue. So, what should we install first? I'm not really going to be using that, so I guess maybe... Uh, yeah, so Vor is controlling our shield, so we don't want him accessing... We don't want to do shields. Unless we can... Oh, we can do both, can't we? I don't know, we can do both. Sure, why not? Um, unless we do want to get a little bit of that strength going. Uh, but that'll be fine for now. Uh, thanks for helping me out back there. No worries, good sir. Debt, and I often pay my debts. I recognize that device. It's a parasitic restraint. We corpus use something similar to keep our robotics in line. So, to settle my debt, I give you a very expensive blueprint. For free! Because I like you. <laughs> and well... A lot of my customers don't live long with these grenier dogs chewing up the system. Here, use your foundry to build a countermeasure device from this blueprint. Good luck. Nice. Okay, but what? Can I just ask? Vor's Ascaris is burrowing into your warframe. I'm worried it will affect your mind. I can't lose you, Tenno. We must restore the ship's foundry immediately. That's adorable, but... A nearby ore extraction colony will have the foundry technology you need. I am certain they will share it with you. Its location has been added to your navigation console. Yeah, th these aren't exactly glowy enough. There's one. Th there is There is one. But it's not a... It, it's, it's only available on Halloween and it's Christmas, so I've got a long way to go for that. But we can't actually buy this yet, so I want to get some platinum and, and do that. Uh, but oh yeah, that, that currency up there in the top right, not the not the, the thing, the, the 50, that's that. That's platinum, that's what I need to buy these. Um, so, and that's premium currency, so in other words, I can't get that for a long while. Uh, so unfortunately, me reading out my entire arsenal is going to have to wait a while. It's, this is going to have to do. Oh, you will be mine. Oh, good old Tenogen. Community created content is absolutely ridiculous how many Cyandanas we actually have. Like, we have all of these. I, I did not actually know. Whoa. Oh, it is looking tough, like. Moth people! Sorry. Um, yeah, I didn't actually know that that many existed. Yep, we're looking decent. Mastery sigil. So that will be reflective of. My mastery. So, um, whenever I, so basically, uh, let me quickly run through this. So, 
as you level up pieces of equipment, you warframe your uh, primary and secondary weapons and your melee weapon, and your uh, not that your companion, you gain mastery XP. And once you've gotten to the end of the mastery rank, you do a mastery test, test, and that levels you up to the next mastery rank. And then you have to keep getting more mastery XP via upgrading your stuff to get to the next mastery rank. And this little symbol here, no, hang on. And this interesting little symbol here, that I'm Master Rank 0 at the moment, so that's that's why this is a really simple, bland-looking mark. But as my rank increases, I believe that should improve and, and match my actual Mastery Rank, uh, which would be nice. That would be, be nice to wear as our front emblem. So, let's get some mods going on. Okay, so we've got some got some decent selections going on there. Sure, why not? Uh, let's get some selections going on here. We might as well just get damage going. Why not? Um, scan no scanner. Let's have a look at you. Oh yeah, something to change the appearance of everything on here. So nice. Let's get that done on you, and let's get the appearance going on you. Right, we're done. Locate the founder segment. So I believe that's going to be a navigation. So let's figure out. No, let's figure out where we're going for this. We are going to. Tenor, we may have a problem. The colony is unresponsive. Get to the surface so we can see what's going on. Is that the? Oh, wait. I've got, I've got a, a message. I had it earlier, but I didn't actually know. Oh, oh, <laughs> oh. Oops. Hang on, wait. Hang on, hang on, hang on. Warframe community team. Warframe community team. Dear Junior Boy, thanks to your generous support in the quest to conquer cancer campaign, I, I had nothing to do with this, during the month of October, all the donation tier rewards have been successfully unlocked community wide. While this campaign comes to a close, the quest continues for those who are affected by all forms of, of the disease. Display and wear these conquer, uh, conquer items to show your support to all those Tenno or not, pressing on in their quest to con conquer cancer. We all lift together, Tenno. That is a very important, that is a, a catchphrase for a quest in the game. We all lift together. Sincerely, Warframe Community Team, these items have been delivered to your inventory. The Conquera Ribbon. I i don't actually know. Uh, sure, even though no one's going to see it. Uh, do I still have those? I, I take it I don't have that because this came out in November. So I imagine I don't actually have that. But, uh, wait. Oh no, 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 I have. That's just, that's just been activated now. Ooh. Ooh, 14 day active sale, really? I'll have to look at that in a second. But, we can delete that now. Cool. Maru. Want primes? There's someone you need to meet. Hey, a tin suit. Looking for hard to find prime gear? Not just yet. Void relics, prime weapons, prime warframes? You need to come to the bazaar. Get someone you need to meet. Uh, got someone you need to meet. Uh, would you believe she can pres she can produce prime gear from the past? Get your shiny butt over to the bazaar and see for yourself, Maru. Woo. Uh... Tuny boy, forget my panic. Bef uh, forget my panic before. Davo was in a dark place. To make up for it, a verve pin penta skin plus an actual penta is waiting for you to claim. Intalia and I have spoken. Have spoken. Have now spoken face to face. Well, face to screen. And she's exactly what she appeared to be. But those fools in the corpus administration are still refusing to release her inher her full inheritance unless they are paid an extra processing fee. I have agreed to send her more money so we can wrap up the deal. Okay, I'm not redeeming anything. I'm not going to bother with any of that. But we have a resource booster, which basically just means that the more when we pick up resources, it gets doubled. That's nice. Oh. It's, yeah, so we have an infested room on our ship. So that's nice. Um, we can't go in here yet. Or any of these rooms, for that matter. <laughs> oh, we will one day. Don't you worry. So, we're looking at a skin, are we not? Ooh, a Conquera Ephemera. So we can put that on. That looks kind of weird, I'm not going to lie, but sure, we can keep it. We, we can we can put it on and we can keep it. Let's go. For now, let's go. Uh, we are... Well, I don't know what that was about with the, uh, the colony going missing. Whoa, whoa, what was that? What, what, was, what was that? All that text. Uh, Vor's Prize. My queens, you were right. The Tenno threat is real. We found one drifting near Earth, but the Lotus knew we were coming. It wasn't near Earth, we were on Earth. But the Lotus knew we were coming. She purged the cryo moments before we had them and sent a squad of Tenno to break our assault. That didn't happen. That's the that's the promo trailer for the game. That's not what happened. They escaped. We are working on tracing them. Separate the Tenno from the flock and it should be easy to kill. We sc we shattered its warframe and expect such an abrupt you didn't shatter the warframe. I don't even in the promo trailer that didn't happen. I never understood what he meant by that. 
uh, and expect such an abrupt cry or purge will have damaged its memories. We uh, ex uh, anxiously await punishment for failing this task. Okay, cool. Yeah, I don't... Yeah, I feel like the, the story of Warframe is always going back and forth on itself, so it's difficult to actually try to come up with a cannon for the game. I love how fast this loads up. And I love that Earth was briefly shown right next to us there. Uh, it didn't have to be. Uh, locate the foundry segment. Let's go. We don't need to watch this. I was afraid of this. The Grenier are here, and I cannot find any signs of living colonists. You still have a job to do. Find the foundry segment. That's okay. Do you, give me a scan in like another ten minutes, and you'll find no uh, no signs of living Grenier. Uh, let's go. So, locate the foundry segment. Let's see. Where is that? Oh no, there's loot all over the place. We gotta, we gotta get that first. So, for the first couple of episodes-ish, or like a, every time uh, I encounter a new tile set, I'll probably do. A prosperous, independent colony until the Grenier arrived. You okay there, Tano? Uh, Lotus. The queens fear you, but I will show them. Their love will return when I deliver you to them. Well. That's very wishful thinking of you, good sir. Oh, well, don't worry about it. Very well, let's pick up the pace. Let's destroy some things. Oh, that actually destroyed my shield. I didn't expect that to be that damaging. I forget that I don't have mods. Well, I do, because it's not very good ones. And I also... F wait. Oh, yeah! Oh my god, I forgot that the Parazon that you guys saw in my arsenal. That's how stealth works now. I keep walking up behind people and whacking them with a sword, expecting to do a stealth kill. That's not how you do stealth kills anymore. And I should know that, because I was playing the game when that change was made. So, you know, I should know that, but I didn't, because I, I was an idiot and forgot. Let me go get this loot. So, like I was saying, is uh, every new tile set that I encounter, I'll spend a bit of time running through it without editing it all out, so you guys can get a feel for the tile set and the, the style of the area that we're in. And then once I start do once things start getting repetitive, like you know, I'm, I'm repeating missions for loot or XP, or you guys have seen the tile set, pretty much everything it has to offer. Unless I encounter something important that's not worth it, I'll end up just cutting most of the mission out as I go from thing to thing. So let's uh, right. So let's get this loot over here. Let's pick this pace up. There we go. That's the one. I took a shotgun blast to the face, and you. Suffered for it. Well, you tried. That's go now with the. Oh no! I thought it was telling me to go somewhere. I didn't realize that we're right here. Just left Good. there and protected. Your ship is one step closer to completion. Now there is one more thing you need to do: eliminate all Grenier and provide justice for the colonists. Now we're talking. <coughs> Soon the worm will be in your spine, and I will control this warframe of yours. I will purge your doting mother and bring you home. You will try. But no, seriously though, Vol, you this is very wishful thinking. I'm going to have to shut that down. Uh, because you seem to be under the impression that you are approaching victory and I am losing the will. Lo well, losing my will. Um, you, you need to rethink that, if I'm being perfectly honest. You know, I know, I know that I, I over-explain things and I, uh, I, I over-enunciate words and drag sentences out for way longer than they need to be, than they need to be and I use big words that have absolutely no purpose in the sentence whatsoever. Well, that's mainly just so that I can buy myself time in a sentence, so that I can say the thing that I mean to say. And what I mean to say is stop right there, you're going down. Why did my screen get slightly brighter when I said that? I know pathetic fallacy is a thing, but that is a fallacy. So, no witnesses, let's leave this place. Because extraction is right there. What? Oh, I leveled up. I thought I'd lost my shields or something. I was like, what? What happened? Right, let's have a look here. foundry segment is ready for installation, operator. Will, will the operator build a cephalon to replace me? No, Odys. You don't need replacing. Stop worrying about it, boy. Is 
That Foundry would... restored. Here, the operator will craft many powerful weapons and tools to exact revenge for dismantling me. To expand your arsenal. Both, as a matter oh, of no. fact. Operator, our component storage has been looted as well. Typical corpus. Sure, the blueprint is free, but jack up the components. Operator, we will need resources in order to build the countermeasure blueprint. Alright, let's do it. Let's go get those resources back from the corpus runes. Um, yeah, sure. Eternal, I just received a very explicit message from your ship, Sevlon. If you're looking for resources, why didn't you just say so? I know just the place, but I demand an apology. My mother is no gymnast, and she would never eat those things. <laughs> oh, this. You can go straight to... Uh, operator, I am sorry. Wow. You may want to get a new ship, Sevlon, when you can afford it. <laughs> That one seems glitched. I've marked your navigation with a place I know. It's good for resources. If you can stand the cold. Oh, I can stand the cold. Tell me, Davo, how many <coughs> glitched cephalons do you know of? Audis, control yourself. We'll get along fine. Oh, you gotta love how fast you can. Dargos Intel suggests that this outpost is host to several rich supply caches. Raid the caches and take what you need. This outpost belongs to the Corpus, a secretive but extremely powerful merchant cult known to be working with the Grenier. Dargo will fill you in. Alright, let's pick up the pace a little bit. Legions of robots, mindless automatons, freaking lasers. Freaking lasers! News, but they're also loaded, which is why you're here. Yes, because we're locked and loaded now. I'm kidding. Um, right, let's do. Keep moving. There is more here. Technically, this is stealing, but don't let that bother you. The corpus aren't exactly beacons of more fortitude either. They sell anything to anyone. But don't get me wrong. I like profits a lot, but I don't sell my wares to the damned Grenier. That's unforgivable. If you guys are wondering what I'm confused about, when did they bring this back? Being able to switch to your melee. For those wondering, you used to be able to switch to your melee and you could hold a button down to block and do things like this, you know, like boom. Uh, and you know, you couldn't shoot your weapon like while you were doing it because you weren't using your, you know, you couldn't shoot your gun because you weren't using your gun. Then they swapped it out, so uh, that way, they swapped it out and they removed um, manual blocking, so that way uh, you, you you just shoot, you just do this, and when you need to hit, hit someone with a melee, you just hit them with a melee. And the idea was that it would it would it would improve the flow of combat in a, in, in the game, right? So instead of you having to like run away, get your melee out, or you know dance around them for a second, get your melee out and start hitting them or anything like that you could just run up smack him in the face and you can still kind of do that while like but you can still kind of do oh dear. this let me just let me, and you could still you could still kind of do that with um without switching to in, in the old system without switching to your melee but you had to but you didn't get uh, access to as many moves uh because you get like combo moves and stuff with your melee but if you get like a combo mod and specific weapons and things like that um so you couldn't, you could, you, yeah, you couldn't use your combos on that if you were just doing this. If you were just doing this, right? Like you were, you had your weapon out, and you decided to hit someone in the face with your sword. You couldn't do um, uh, combos and stuff. You had to switch to your melee and uh, to do the combos. But then they switched out so that you could do the combos, um, even if. So, so when you hit someone in the face with a melee, you can just run around with the sword, and you don't have to, you don't have to uh, go through the effort of, of switching to your sword to do the melee. You can just do the combos while using your gun. Um, so, but now we're going back to this system. Like, when did that happen? Good work, but you're not done yet. Find the next cache. You almost have what you need. Cash for Otis, no, you're breaking up. Bo, you got anything to say for yourself? No? Oh, that's okay. I'm not saying anything for you.
Ah, oh, look at that. Two detonite ampoules. A, a rare resource which is only supposed to give you one per batch. But we get two because we have a resource booster. Right, we are approaching the destination. And I need to get myself some sensor mods because I miss being able to see all the enemies on the map. Right. Ugh. So, what are we looking at now? What fancy loot have we got for us this time? Time for extraction tomorrow. It would appear I have. I, I didn't hear that. The Ascaris has reached your mind and rendered your lotus mute. You will return to me over your own free will. Alternatively, I'm going to return to my ship, and then I'm going to render you mute, because that will be within my power. And then I'm going to return to you, as per your wishes, and demonstrate to you what power is, good sir. Because you seem to be the under, the under the impression, falsely, I might add, that you have power over me. And you would be wrong. Ah, uh, here we go. I don't know how warp drive is supposed to work with, uh, you know, y y like y you warp drive into a building. Surely, I think. Operator, are you all right? Yes. This part of your journey is over, Tenno. I admire you for your struggle, but now, <laughs> I am part of you. Amazing. Lotus, do something. Help the operator. That's quite all right. We Grenier are millions strong, but with a flaw, we are diseased, rotting, sterile. But now we have you. Incorrect. Operator, do not abandon me again. Build the countermeasure. I did. I did this for my love, my queens. They will forgive my insubordination when I deliver you to them. Our love no. will be reborn as we feed on your divine blood. Our children will flourish without disease. Incorrect. And I will die at last. At peace, father, grandfather. That's adorable, but if you wanted to die, you could have just said what so. What do you think you're doing? It's not, not what I'm doing. It's what I've done. Ten up. Good. You managed to disarm Boris Ascaris. I thought... I thought I lost you. Oh no. The Ascaris had a tampering failsafe. It's burrowed into you and armed itself. We'll need to find Vor before it detonates. Sounds like a plan. Get to navigation. Boarding a Grenier ship to access their personnel records will be the fastest way to find Vor. Sure, let's do it. Operator, what are you waiting for? I have a headache. Lotus, that was adorable. Thank you for caring. Let's go. Or this assumes finding Vor implies violence? No implication necessary, good sir. The systems on this Grenier Galleon can be made compatible with your ship. Find and extract a navigation segment. Find and extract a navigation segment. Sounds like a plan. Let's make our way that way. Oh, I can't wait to get like the galaxy and get the you range on it. Murdered my sons and disgraced me before my queen. And I didn't even take health damage Soon. doing it. The Ascaris will complete its task and bring you to me. I thought we'd gotten over this, this vor. That's not happening. Yeah, I can't just, I can't just break um, a container and just get the loot from it. I have to go up and pick it up because I don't have a companion which drags all the loot in the area to me. Oh, I miss vacuum. Or, or worm, or Helios. Helios was, was the G because he just scanned enemies for you. And that was always good. And scanning is very useful for figuring out their, their weaknesses and such. But let's go find ourselves this nav component without you interfering. 
Yo, I'm not entirely sure how much loot is actually available by this point in the game. Like, I've been getting all this loot and stuff. But I don't actually know if things like, um, like special caches, uh... Ooh. Go on, just go on, just do it, just go on, just blow up. Absolute useless type enemy type. 40 damage. So, what have you for me? Ooh. You have a choice. You can extract now, or you can disable this galleon and save the colonists. That's not really much of a choice. Colonists could jeopardize this mission. No, it won't. I recommend you head straight to extraction, but the choice is yours. Correct. It is. Four. You, sir, are testing my nigh unlimited patience. Is attacking your systems. Your shield capacity has just been halved. No. You're wasting precious time, Tano. It, it hasn't. In fact, it's increased since but the beginning of the mission. But are you sure you're you're not on my side here? It's. I'm going. I may have to make a little bit of a bogey report to Digital Extremes here, because as much as it doesn't matter, because this uh, this you part of the game is the easy. Ship's power systems. Destroy the reactor. Oh, a little sabotage. Destroy the fuel injectors. Right. Let's sort these guys out. Let's do this. Oh, come on, nearly perfect. Oh, this ought to be fun. Oh, the Mark 1 Bratton has been uh, upgraded. It's been leveled up, you could say. Um, what was I saying about before? I was chatting about him. What was I saying? I can't remember. Um, Oh yeah, oh no no, it was with the uh, the nav systems. Um, yeah, I don't know how much of that was, um, I don't know how uh, much the, I'm I'm losing it here guys, just, just bear with me. Oh, that's the sound of a galleon cannon. Uh, good thing it's not actually aiming at anything because I destroy it. Um, so, I'm, I'm struggling with, with what it was I was saying. Oh yeah, so at the beginning of the game, I'm not actually sure how much loot we have access to finding in uh, just lying around the place. Like, can we find special caches? Can we find um, Ayrton sculptures? Don't worry, we'll find out what those are soon. They're sculptures called Ayrton sculptures. Um, they're very useful. And can we find, like, you know, can we find, well, well we can't find Ayrton loot. We won't be able to find stars either. Uh, yeah. The colonist oh, ship has escaped. I admire your noble intentions, Tenno, but you must survive for the future of the system. I mean, there are more Tenno, and let's be honest, Lotus, me saving a single colony isn't going to jeopardize the system. I I'm, I'm, a, I'm confident enough to claim that as fact. Uh, qualified for Master of Rank test. When you are ready. Proceed to the navigation console. Let's do it. Install segment. That's more like the, the animation we're looking, at, we're looking at. You need to bring Vor down. He thinks he can capture you again. Don't worry. I will be with you. Let us show him how much you have learned. Worry not, Lotus. But before I blow up, I'm going to take my mastery rank. I'm going to level up. Uh, you have qualified for the mastery rank one. We've been playing for longer than an hour. Uh, you can only attempt this once per day. Are you ready to become an initiate? We get a plus 500 daily standing limit. That's good. Plus one base mod capacity. That's good. And plus 50 void tray storage. That's good. Uh, base mod capacity. Don't worry. There isn't a limit to the amount of mods you can have. There's a limit to the amount of mods that you can... Uh, th there's, a there's a limit to the strength of mod that you can have on Warframe. So before I do that, let me just quickly show to you guys right now. Um, each mod, you've seen a little number in the top right of each mod. That is mod that is the amount of mod capacity that it takes. This is your capacity up here. And without leveling your equipment up, um, without leveling your equipment up, your mastery rank determines how what what your base mod capacity is. So it determines the mod capacity of um, it, it determines the mod capacity of an unranked. Uh, 
or like level like level zero piece of equipment. So let's say I'm massively ranked ten, then even with an unranked level zero um, piece of equipment, it's going to have ten mod capacity. So double what I have now, basically. Uh, so to begin test. Let's go. I love that loading time. Ugh. A Tenno must be a master of all their weapons. Prove yourself with your primary weapon. Good stuff. Easy. Let's do it. Right. Right, come on. Let's get some headshots going. Nice. Wave one completed. Excellent. Continue. So we've got to uh, kill a certain amount of enemies before running out of time. We've got two minutes to kill five, so I think we're, we're pretty much guaranteed to win this one. Obviously the first few mastery ranks are pretty easy. Um, so, whoa. so we've not really got much to worry about here. Um, this is a primary weapon test, so we're only looking at primary weapons here. There we go, wave two, come on. Yeah, let's do it. We've got eight in three minutes, so very easy. Nine, impo well, it's impossible to fail, really. Um, but no, it's not technically impossible, but it's, you're not going to lose. You've got no reason to lose. Uh, four enemies. There we go. Wave three completed. All waves completed. We are now mastery rank one. A formidable performance. This test is now complete. Another job well executed. I didn't expect the music to go on for that long, but that's probably going to be one of my favorite soundtracks in ever I, I like that soundtrack it's good uh plus 500 yeah yeah, yeah. so we got all those rewards nice so we have we are now master rank one we are initiate we have completed the trial master rank one achieved tuny boy in passing my test you continue to prove yourself and grow stronger this mastery slate has been commissioned to honor your achievement the lotus these items have been delivered to your inventory mastery rank uh, initiate mastery slate. Structure recognize your achievement in reaching the rank of number of, of one. Initiate. All right, cool. We can delete that uh, message. So, let's go kill ourselves a cap. Are you ready, Tenno? Facing war is the only way to rid yourself of him permanently. Nothing is ever permanent in this game, Lotus. Let's begin. Right. This is our chance. Vor has been stripped of his elite guard. He is vulnerable. Take him out. Oh, sure, let's do it. Simple stuff. I could have saved the Grenier, but they cast me out. Maybe it's not too late to draw your divine blood. It kind of is. It was too late when you put the Asterix on. This is our chance. Vor has been stripped of his oh, elite Asterix, guard. Sorry. He is vulnerable. Take him out. I will put you down like a rabbit, Kubro. Kubro, is that what we're calling him now? Kubro? 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 I don't know, I always get these mixed up. Let's go. Right, alarm's been triggered. Sounds good. Let's kill you. Finish you off because you might not be elite, but you're still a guard. Oh, you, you fell down a flight of stairs. Right, let's snag ourselves a bit of loot before we leave. Just, you know, just for the road, for the road. Or, for orbit, I should say. Captain Vaughn, you are welcome to help your friends out, by the way. Just, you know, make it make the whole situation a bit quicker for yourself. Ooh, I have radial blind. Do you, stand up? Do you realize your Lotus has sent you to die? Uh, no, because I only realized the truth. One way or another. There is the assassination target. You know what to do. You are very close to death, sir. Courtesy of Radio Blind, which is why I chose Excalibur, because Excalibro is my Excalibro. He's... 
easily the favorite. Uh, okay, I'm just saying. I'm, I, I, you know what, Vol? I have five lives. You don't. Uh, well, I have four revives. You know, five total lives. So, have a nice day. The Ascaris detonator has just disintegrated. It's as if it was directly connected to Vor. They're done here. Go to extraction. All right. Sure. See you guys at extraction. You've done it, Tenno. Vor's Ascaris is gone. You are free now. Yay! But your work has just begun. The origin system is in chaos, and it needs you, Tenno. Oh, this is gonna take much longer Vor than ten episodes. Vor is just a part of the Grenier machine. And we have seen that the Corpus have begun amassing weapons of their own. It is a dangerous time. Ordis will gladly assist the operator in cutting a bloody path in whatever mission they choose. We will be at your side. There will be others too. It is time for the Tenno to return. So, what mission will you do next? Good question, Lotus. Tenno, now that you have freed yourself from Vor and his Ascaris, you have a new mission, one of your own making. Know that I am only your guide. You are or you are your own warrior. You decide what battles to fight. Allow me to suggest a course of action. Seek out like-minded fighters. Tenno are more effective in groups. Execute missions to unlock junctions and open new paths of exploration. Use the credits you earned in battle to buy blueprints in the market, then hunt down resources and craft those items in your foundry. Customize your weapons and warframes using the mod bench. Different enemies are vulnerable to different combinations of mods. Experiment to discover the most effective loadouts. Finally, stay alert. The Grenier and Corpus are tireless, you, and you are the only thing standing between them and total domination of the Origin system. I am counting on you, Tenno, the Lotus. Thank you for those words. Vor's prize has escaped Vor. Vor's prize is now complete. We've already read through that, we don't need to read it again. <clears throat> New quest, Sire's Vigil. We could move on to that, but we could also not. Master Rank 3 acquired, that would be a good place to start. But, one thing that I could be doing is getting on with some of these other nodes. Uh, doing a little bit of exploration, getting some endo to unlock, and, and uh, you know, getting some non-flawed non mods, that would be good. Uh, I could also unlock this. Uh, apply four mods to a single warframe or weapon. Uh, sure, we could do that. Upgrade any mod to rank two or higher through the fusion process. Uh, we could do that. That's that's always good. That would be the only other mod to do, really, wouldn't it? Oh no, no, we can. Oh, oh we can go to. We can visit Cetus and we unlock all these missions. Interesting. I wonder what I need to do to do this. Uh, find Frontier Grenier in missions on Earth. Uh, clear a path of Venus to access Mercury. Oh, I see. Complete your work, you don't to visit the Codex in your office. Oh, ooh. Codex. Right, let's visit the Codex. Uh, that's here, right? Uh, yes, Universe. Uh, Operator, Ordis wonders, what are you thinking about? One or two things, good sir. So, what would be a very good idea for me to do is to visit Excalibur and his good old... Uh, codex log, and let's read through it. The sentience had won. They had turned our weapons, our technology, against us. The more advanced we became, the greater our losses. The war was over unless we found a new way. In our desperation, we turned to the void, the blinding night, the hell space where our science and reason failed. We took the twisted few that had returned from that place. We built a frame around them, a conduit of their affliction. Gave them the weapons of the old ways, gun and blade. A new warrior, a new code was born. These rejects, these Tenno, became our saviors. Warrior gods, cast in steel and fury, striking our enemies in a way they could never comprehend. Excalibur was the first. The Orokin Warframe Archives. So. In the time of the Orokin, there was a war. There was a war with an enemy known as the Sentients, and they were winning because they were powerful like that. Then they took the Tenno, and they built frames around us, known as Warframes. We then won the war for them because we'd be badasses like that. You know what? That'll do for now. 
that's about all the time we've got for today. I hope you guys had about as much fun as I did, because I definitely had a lot of fun. And I'll see you guys next time. Bye, have a great time.